that forces intense growth in organic matter in human protein. The Bacchus plant use it to obtain a large amount of the enzymes required for DNA extraction. Generator has been spotted at your current location. Neutralize the enemy forces and disable the generator using high voltage fuses.
in the third fuse. It would be best to establish how far the Vulnus were able to progress their experiments. They may have scattered the data, but we must examine it, even if it takes time to recover it. The terminal has been accessed. Checking information. Initiating hacking sequence.
terminal access. Inputting security deactivation codes. Done, come to the outpost. No, wait, would it be faster if I came to you? <laughs> what are you doing, sightseeing? This operation is a waste of time, a complete waste. You keep telling me I need to cooperate, but I think you guys are the uncooperative ones. Jeremy, unless your receive is having issues, there is no way you didn't know we were in the middle of an operation. It's prohibited for descendants to deactivate the receives during an operation. If you manually deactivated your receive link, I think that would make your attitude toward the operation uncooperative. I'd watch what you're saying, Glay. I carried out my side of the operation perfectly. I scouted the entire area thoroughly. I've even confirmed that the Ancestors' ruins are in the deepest part of Vespers. How dare you question my attitude? God, I don't know why Alpha looks out for you guys so much. Maybe he feels sorry for you being possessed by the ghost or guide or whatever. If it's because he pities you, well, I guess normal me has no choice but to be understanding. I'll distract the enemy's backlines just for you pitiful lot. You can follow me and push through. You three, no, is it four? Anyway, you're all deployed, so let's cooperate and get this operation done without any mistakes. Also, I've been assigned to retrieve the Iron Heart, so don't any of you think about touching it. I'm warning you. Clay, your anger levels are rising. I'm doing my best to let it go. genetic modification we saw earlier was successful. Now, why don't you come here and give my cold, frozen body a hug, friend? <laughs> Those bulkous bastards. They weren't just researching ways to open the vault. Now it's clear why the Order of Truth was there. To create this monstrosity. If they only wanted to retrieve the DNA, they would have sent the Legion of Immortality. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Hey, hey. <laughs> How hard do you think it? What a brainless brute. You really want to fight me, huh? This device can force channels to change. 
If we destroy it, we will be able to connect to the HQ channel again. Check the reconnection confirmed. The Aceive channel is back online. Guy, please modify this code so that the channel cannot be disconnected again. I have established the defense of security code. Communications will not be affected in the future. <laughs> it doesn't feel too bad to have my limbs cut off like this. <laughs> it almost feels like I'm dreaming. I'll send you a little present soon. What is that? There's a strange image on the command hut. Is that... Jaber? <laughs> Oscars don't usually dream. <laughs> But thanks to the Arche Serum, I dream my every moment. You can call me Jaber. The serum that was injected into the Vulgus was from Jaber. My heart toxicity increased significantly. The vault must be nearby. I'll send a signal to Jeremy. Jeremy, do you read me? Jeremy. Jeremy, respond. Damn. Hang on just a little longer, everyone. It's so nice to see your face, Prayer. <laughs> Can you call me Jaber? Just this one. Here I am. Eamon's delay has changed our plans, but it can't be helped. In my next dream, I'll be dancing with your core! It, haven't you? Listen. If you spotted the target, you should have said so. What are you doing here by yourself? gotten everybody so riled up. <laughs> That's it. That's what makes us the Ironheart. It's way more impressive than what the rumors say. Hey, how long do you plan on just standing there? Go back to Albion and bring reinforcements or something. Why are you still here? Go!
just get to the point. Descendant, do you have something positive to report, finally? Where's the Ironheart now? What? I gave the order for Jeremy to retrieve the Ironheart. I never did that. There must have been a misunderstanding. Nell, did you send those instructions? I've done no such thing over any official channel, and even unofficially. I have no reason to contact him. Something's not right. Could it be? Nell, contact Jeremy. Now. I can't get through to Jeremy. His Aceive has been deactivated. And there's no record of him entering Albion either. It can't be. Jeremy is still a descendant. Even if he's sometimes led astray. He's a descendant fighting for humanity who despises the Vulgus with every fiber of his being. Alpha, we should see if we can detect Jeremy's arcade and traces of the Iron Heart through the guide. All descendants on standby. Contact the guide for assistance is required. Command has identified Jeremy to last known whereabouts. <laughs> Through Jeremy's RK, which I am not synced with, my operating system is rejecting this function. Even now, alarm bells are ringing. My functions have been interrupted and my system cannot be recalibrated. Descendant, I am in no doubt that a Colossus is heading towards Ingress at this very moment. Please transfer my sensory field amplification algorithm to Seneca. If we can intercept that Colossus, and recalibrate my system. Jeremy and the Ironheart can be found. Please, help me, Descendant. It appears we have no choice. Please handle whatever the Guide needs first. As Alpha said, we cannot rely on the Guide alone. HQ will do their best to identify Jeremy's last known location and prepare for- Descendant, is this code related to the Void? This algorithm is sophisticated enough to be applied right away. This is truly incredible. So this is the power of the guide that the descendants have spoken of. But now is not the time to marvel at it. Based on the results calculated from the amplified sensory field, it seems a powerful colossus. The executioner is heading toward Ingress. As you likely recall from your descendant training, the blade wielded by the Executioner is a sensitive conductor. If you allow it to power up, it will increase the time you spend in the Void. And the likelihood of failing to intercept the Colossus increases exponentially. Descendant, please proceed with the intercept immediately.
space-time fabric of the Void is extremely illogical. You succeeded in intercepting the Executioner. An extraordinary display of skill. If there was a descendant like you a century ago, I'm certain we would have been able to stop the Apocalypse. There are no what-ifs in history, of course. But the Apocalypse has left such a deep wound on humanity. Regardless, if we allow ourselves to ponder all of the what-ifs, perhaps things would be better if the Iron Hearts had never existed in this world. Every time an Iron Heart is uncovered, it's as if the Colossi are awoken and head to Ingress. But ironically, we also need the Iron Hearts to stop the Colossi. It is one of the great paradoxes. Descendant, perhaps this is exactly why the Ancestors sealed the Iron Hearts in vaults. I'm beginning to suspect that perhaps the Ancestors hid the Iron Hearts away to prevent history repeating itself. We will need extensive preparation for the moment when the third Iron Heart is revealed. Hmm. There is much that I would like to discuss with you. And also with the entity known as the Guide, if possible. However, we do not have the luxury of time right now. HQ is urgently looking for you, Descendant. You should make your way there as quickly as possible. Descendant. Thanks to you, the stability of my system was restored. However, the Iron Heart has slipped from our grasp. While you were stopping the Colossus, I delivered the necessary information to Enzo. Ah, Descendant. You're here. Thank you for all your hard work with the Intercept battle. Unfortunately, we need to drag you into another operation before you get a chance to rest. Albion has entered uncharted territory. A descendant has committed treason. A descendant. Someone who should have been humanity's beacon of hope. Damn it! How could this have happened? HQ has officially denounced Jeremy as a traitor. A rapid arrest operation is in progress. Enzo received intel from the guide and was first on the scene. Jeremy is heading towards Echo Swamp. As the enemy's attention is keenly focused on this location, and because of the swampy terrain, deployment of forces on a large scale will be difficult. To make matters worse, we've lost contact with Esimo. He was carrying out another operation in the area. Esimo's support was vital. Enzo won't be able to command and fight by himself. Our lack of manpower is delaying the operation. If we don't hurry, we'll be delivering the Ironheart to the Vulgus on a silver platter, after we've worked so hard to get it. We must prevent that from happening at all costs. Rules of engagement for Jeremy will be sent separately. If possible, I would like to have him brought back alive. I want to hear what he was thinking as his commander, and why he did what he did. Go after Jeremy, and please, find the Ironheart and bring it back. I will tell Enzo to prepare to resume the operation. Understood. Descendant, wrap up any preparations for reinforcements quickly, and head to the Misty Woods outpost in Echo Swamp. Enzo is awaiting your arrival. 